Once again, welcome back to my channel server again. My name is Dr. Lokhkan Singh and today we are going to see that how do we figure out the particular admin panel of WordPress. So I'll figure out here, like there's a particular uh, URL slash WP admin. So over here, I do not have any username and password so far. So how do I figure it out? Okay. So in order to host a website from uh, WP admin or maybe from Bitnami, so there are some steps. So first of all, you will log into this particular instance or what you can do here is you can figure out here. You can uh, go to this particular, uh, okay, instance state, actions, instance setting, get user logs, okay, get system logs, instance logs, we have to figure out instance settings networking image and template monitor and troubleshoot yes so guys get system blocks if we figure out here so there will be a particular component where we will be able to figure out the username and password for bitnami you'll have to these these logs very carefully so these are system reboot log we are still able to see that and guys keep this thing in mind very very carefully that these logs are available only for once. Once the system is rebooted, you will not be able to figure out the particular username and password later on. So these details are available. So you, as you can see, this video is getting recorded. So I'm not going to pause it because I really want to show that these are the details which really works. So this is the username and this guy, this is a particular password because after creating this video, definitely I'm going to remove uh, these particular things from my system. I'll terminate this instance and uh, if required, I'll create new one. So obviously guys, if you see, so I'm able to see this particular thing here. I'm going to, I'm not, go, okay, let us save it for now or let me keep it somewhere on my notepad. So the particular password is this and the username is user. I can define here server again WordPress. Right, so that is it. So information is available here. I'm not going to save it now. Okay, guys. So what I can do, uh, what I can see here is I can figure out the particular commands. Let us say that someone has commented already here. Right. So Lokendra, if I want to approve here, I can hit here apply. So my command will be approved. And if I try to access this particular you like IP address once again within my like new tab, so I shall be able to figure out that this is approved. Right, so the particular commands and new stuff, whatever it is, so I can figure out one message is here. So one, what is the message? Right, guys. So we can like uh, this is approved. I can approve it, and uh, after that, if I once again see the IP address here, so that should be visible to me. Lock in the on hello world. Recent comment. This one. And these are the things which we can figure out here, right guys? Okay. <clears throat> now, what else we can see here? Let us say we talk about appearance. We can select any other theme here. This is the def default theme here. Let us say we have to figure out like any new theme. So we can activate or maybe we can look for, we can look for any new theme here. Maybe these are the particular popular ones. Right, these are the particular themes which we can figure out whatever theme we want, we can figure out. Let us say I would like to have this one. So I can install this theme as well. So that will be depending on me, like how do I want to use it? How do I want my website should be looking like? So like there are a lot of themes which are available and most popular ones are these like uh, 20, like uh, 2017 and all like 2022 and whatever that particular themes are. So these are available. So this is also installed like I can activate it. Right guys, so as soon as I'll hit my website, like, uh, so obviously, like this is modified now, right? So this is how we can modify the particular things. Like if I want to, if I want to refresh it, so like things are back to normal. So my WordPress admin page is available here. Now let us say if I want to update some sort of uh, like component, like component here, if I want to install like uh, Google analytics for it, maybe for Jetpack, maybe for simple tags, like uh, the WordPress mail SMTP. So these are the particular components which are available for free for me to use so I can easily manage it. Right guys. 
so this is how maybe if you want to manage your post you want to write any new post here you want to write you want to edit hello world so whatever you want you can edit it here so these are particular like uh, some of the tips wordpress is providing here to get it started if i want to edit this particular post so i can hit edit button and obviously i shall be allowed to edit it so over here whatever i want i can define let us say this is my first post on server gyan right i'll hit here update that is getting updated so based on that i shall be able to figure out and i shall be able to view it in my next app this is my first post on post on server gyan this is how guys like we can modify the particular stuff here right so i guess we are good like we have restored the particular password in fact we have seen like how to modify it and other things so that is it for this video guys with the next video we are going to see like how do we point this particular to uh, dns right guys thank you so very much for watching have a good time and happy learning if you are new to my channel so please do like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so very much have a good time happy learning